I was thinking about like these three light bulb moments that I've had since joining WordPress Elevation and, and, and Digital Mavericks that have uh, helped me in the decision making process to just go out and sell these signature systems and not have to worry too much about having the framework perfect or, or anything like that. The first one was when you drew this, right? Mm -hmm. So in one of your kind of presentations uh, that you put out on Facebook, you drew this thing and it was the correlation between the price at which you can sell a website and the um, turnover of the business. Mm -hmm. And the reason why it was a big like light bulb moment for me was we had the realization that we don't really do any of that. Right. We don't, you know, kind of like tender for work um, and we, we don't sit in a cheap space. We don't sit in a kind of mid tier space and we don't do expensive websites. Um, and, you know, for, for us, you know, it was all, oh, we're an agency, but we don't do that. You know, what do we do? And we came back to our kind of like tagline of, you know, we, we get people out of the pickle. We are more of a, acquisition agency we look for weakness here because the product is rubbish this is whips yeah. squared space stuff like that. yeah uh, we you know normally look for weakness here uh because maybe the you know the it might still be a wordpress or a shopify site you know uh you know but maybe it just wasn't implemented you know properly and, and maybe the agency owner kind of like dropped the ball or, or whatever um and we acquire a lot out of the top space because um you know often people feel like if they yeah, maybe got ripped off or maybe they, you know, the post launch products are expensive or, you know, the care plans too expensive and, and all the rest of it. So what comes to me is the variety of, um, you know, small problems to solve. Hey, whoops is no good. Hey, the guy that did our websites disappeared. Hey, we got kind of ripped off. Right. And then we stay true to this, which is, you know, we will get you out of that pickle for a very long time. This was us design, develop, host. I don't like either of those two products as a business owner, right? Mm. I like this one, right? And our new model is design, dev, care plan. And I love this one. And what it's meant for us is we have this enormous pool of existing happy clients that we have small, uh, solved a small problem for. The second one was this way that you rate the client. Big aha moment for us, which was, we kind of have rules of what we do in our business. You know, we have kind of um, places where in the past we, you know, get caught, you know, operating out of our wheelhouse. And normally it's because we break one of these three things, you know, so it's very important to get at least two big stacks in one of these. We don't actually mind if there's no budget. Coming back to that slide, um, we actually operate here a lot. A free website before it launches to help a, a person migrate out of, self, uh, out of a job into self-employment. We do lots of that. We actually call it our cucumber clients, uh, given that uh, uh, cucumber is what a gherkin turns into, right? Since it's been pickled. Um, and so um, we don't mind doing free websites or low budget websites, right? Passion is almost now, you know, the, the second two are the really important ones. Does that client show, uh, you know, the, the traits of someone who wants to be best in their industry is, is one of the, the real kind of special ones for us. And does the client know what their ears are for? Do they respect, you know, the advice? Mm. Can we obtain, you know, uh, obtain a little bit of authority? Are they going to listen and, and stuff like that? And so with those first two, you know, light bulb moments stacked up, we had a kind of uh, a realization that we had a big pool of existing clients, right? Some of them, you know, maybe about, you know, it's probably less than 30% have some form of existing post-launch product. So what we wanted to look for was people that don't have a post launch product, because obviously that just steals revenue from another source, especially for the first six. But we wanted to find six people in the existing clients that scored really high, uh, yeah, scored really high, given that we you know, do charge a, a significant fee for our uh, post launch, uh, our, our um, signature system. So look for people who scored really high on these three, right? That sat there, existing client, um, and didn't interfere with post launch products that we already had. But really, it's leading into the third light bulb moment, the big thing that I got from, from you, WordPress Elevation and the Digital Mavericks. Do you know what it is? It's just to go wide and to go deep. What I'm looking for is their problem and their motivation. 
we're really scared because we tender every five years and our tender is coming up. Um, we've been stuck at $660,000 turnover every year for four years and we want to get to a million. Um, if you do the homework right, if you do the presentation well, the business owner will tell you what their problem is.